everyone, welcome back to our channel, Cooking with Kiara. Before we start today, I want to say a huge thank you to Chef Anthony. The falafel was so good. I had a really good time cooking with you. I hope you come back soon. I have a request from from New Zealand, Megan Lee, to make something sweet. So this is for you. This recipe comes all the way from France. Thank you for the new recipe, Eleanor. Today we're making beignet. In English, they call it French donut. So let's get started. So the first step is to get a mug and milk and butter. You put the milk in the mug and then add the butter and you put it in the microwave you don't want to make it too hot let's go to the microwave after you have melted the butter add the yeast crack an egg and then whisk it up add this egg into the milk mixture and then whisk it. Add it into a bigger bowl. Maybe I haven't mixed it well, so I'm gonna whisk it with a whisk to make it nice and not clumpy. And then you wanna add sugar, a couple of pinches of salt, and then you want to mix. I'm done with the whisk, so and now I'm going to add the flour and use a spatula. You don't want to do it little by little, you just want to dump it in and just fold it in. I'm going to go in with, with my hands. The dough is still sticky, so I'm going to use some flour on my hands. It's time to knead. It's time to knead it on the bench. Don't forget to put um, a little flour on the bench because you don't want it, the dough to stick. I have some flour on the bottom, so I'm going to use that. I don't want to waste that much flour. So that should be enough for me. Keep on doing it. When you have kneaded into a nice bowl like I have, roll it out with a rolling pin. Transfer this dough onto a cutting board. Time to get your cookie cutters. I'm gonna choose flour, a circle, big heart, and a stop. Let's get cutting. Look at how much cute shapes I made. Now it's time to fry them up. You want the oil to be 180 degrees to fry up the donuts. Cooking the donuts won't take that long, so keep your eyes on it. When, when they puff up, you want to turn them over. As you can see, the donuts do not take long to fry up. Put them on the tray to drain the oil. The last step is to add powdered sugar to the donut. 
and voila. This is how you make the most easiest donuts ever. Time to taste test. Nice and soft. Thank you again for this amazing recipe, Eleanor. So much fun to make and it was so easy so I would like to make it lots of time. I like to make it and I hope that you like it and this is your day Megan Lee. I hope you like this video. If you are going to make these donuts, please send a photo. I am waiting for you. Chef Anthony, I've got these donuts for you. Please share them with your wife. I hope you like them. Please subscribe to my channel and like and I hope to see you soon. Bye!